Wow, I can already see the, oh my goodness. Wow. <laughs> Is it nice? What a comedy act. You're the joke and I'm not. <laughs> Morning guys, welcome to another vlog. Lee is just editing yesterday, it's like a big production line this. He finishes that, I start the next one. So we're just, we're today we are... Can you mute it? No, I'm going to finish it. Well, I can't do this. Go to the room, go to the bedroom. Bog off. So today we're going to, we've got a, a vineyard tour booked up in the hillside. So that's about two o'clock. So we were going to go to Arecife this morning. We're still undecided whether we're going to go and see that. We've never visited it before, so we've no idea what to expect. And if anything, if yesterday's anything to go by, when we went to Fortaventura, we expected nothing and it was an absolutely amazing day. So we're kind of like pushing ourselves to go out there and do it. Just a bit of motivation. It is just a city in there, I think. It's not. It's, it's a city. It's got museums underwater. It's got all sorts of stuff. And it's got shops. Which is why I don't want to go. What? I don't want to shop. Is there a pound shop you want to go? Well, so what we're going to do, we're going to have breakfast now. And I'll have a, I'll look it up on my phone whilst we're having breakfast. Okay, then. Right, come on. Have you finished that? Let me go and have my, yes, fruit and uh, yoghurt and cereal. Is it rendering? It's rendering, yes. Yes, it is vlog rendering. Time my health breakfast. Whatever. You are going very German this morning. There's enough here. Bread, cheese and hams. So another boatload of customers must have come to the hotel because it's absolutely rammed this morning. Absolutely. We struggled to get a seat. Nice cheese. Mm. Right, we've finished breakfast, we've got ready and we are going out. We are going to Arecife. So we're going to a city centre in a foreign country and Nick's driving there. I'm scared. A bit nervous. Yeah, but I refuse to give in to fear so if I'm scared of something, I won't not do it. I'll do it to get over the fear, which I think is a good way of approaching things. So we're going to drive to Arecife. It's only about 10, 15 minutes away, isn't it? Yeah. And um, we're going to go up. This is the plan anyway. The Grand Hotel, which is the biggest hotel in Lanzarote, and have a coffee at the top in a cafe called the Star Cafe, which we've seen recommended on TripAdvisor. So. One of the things that we've been looking at all this holiday is we've done all the stuff off the beaten track and we've got all the normal, all the normal touristy things. So I've actually downloaded um, a new app called Google Trips, which basically collects people's experiences and does reviews. It's a bit like TripAdvisor, but mm. by Google. Mm. Um, so we've been using that. So we've been using look, that to, to, to find, to do. yeah, find places and things. And this is why we've got this vineyard from today. We've picked the one with the most reviews. Yeah, cool. I rang them up yesterday, and we've got that at two. That's this afternoon. Let's go. So these are the roads just on by our hotel in uh, Costa Tiquis. It's quite easy to drive here, isn't it? We haven't told people where we've stayed yet, have we? No, it's, co it's called the Hotel Los Zocos Resort. Club Resort. Club Resort. Los, Los I love Zocos. people talking over me when I'm talking. It's not a hotel. So it's called the Los... Los... You, I'll do it to you, shall I? Los Zocos Club Resort. Well done! Now I'll get back to what I was saying. Um, these are the roads around the hotel in Costa Tiquis. And it's Take pretty. The next right on the, the next Cali right. Los Dragos. Next right. Here. Yeah. It's pretty easy to drive, isn't it? Here. Yeah. Apart from at night when it's not very well lit. So if you've never driven over here before, um, do it during the day, not at night. Yeah. Never drive at night no. in Spain. My God. But it's pretty easy to drive, and the car costs ninety, a hundred euros. Was it about? Hundred euros. Well, it was ninety-three for a, for six days for a non-automatic. But yeah. I always get an automatic because it's one less thing to think about. Yeah. And we got it for five days for a five-door one, a hundred and seven euros. Palmeiras, That's it. That's hundred and seven euros. Hundred and seven euros. Thanks for interrupting, Google. And we're going left here. So getting here was quite easy. Parking, that was another thing. So we're currently parked in a muck track somewhere with some bloke that just seems to be waving his arms like a buffoon. Lee's the one that's basically needs a drink to get over the stress of it. I'm the one that's driven. And there's the guy waving his arms like he's some <laughs> kind of conductor. <laughs> what the hell that means, I've no idea. Anyway, we've ignored him and just parked where we wanted. Right, let's go and explore our Nice little uh, port here for our old fishing boats. Little busker. And you can just see the hotel where we're going, just at the top there, in blue and windows. So uh, I'm going to walk on here to it. Right, so we're on the front, 
And I don't there's... think we're quite a way out of town, you know. Yeah, I don't think this is the main bit. Uh, there's a castle out there, or a port, or whatever An it is. Ancient port, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And a beautiful view there of the sea. I guess if you're going to come here, you're better off doing your research on the history and what things you yeah. want to see because it's so big. But we're heading towards the hotel. Mm. So you can go over this old bridge to get to that fort. Yeah, oh, there's a new one at the side of it. Hopefully we might have time to go over once we've been to the hotel. So you fancy a game of dominoes, you can have it there. Fancy a game of dominoes, Nick? Domino competition. Yeah. Yeah. So there's the hotel and it's the biggest building, the tallest building in Lanzarote. Right, here we are. The Grand Hotel. Are you sure it's called the Grand Hotel? No idea, you tell me. Eh? You tell me. Well, we'll see That's when we get there. <laughs> the Hilton Hotel in Leeds is bigger. Yeah, but they have, rules on, they have rules on this island where you're not allowed to build over a certain height. So I'm not sure how they got away with this. So we've been looking on TripAdvisor, as I said. And some people said there's a cafe right at the top called the Star Cafe and said it has spectacular views. So, show us the way. Right, so it's actually called the Arecife Grand Hotel and Spa, five star hotel. Yeah. Nick's already off in. So the cafe is called the Star City and it's on floor 17, so we need to go find a lift. Right, come on then. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go to floor 17. Star City. Wow, I can already see the, oh my goodness. Wow, 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 wow. Let's just take a look. Yeah. Oh no, it's the airport north of it. Wow, look at that. Oh my god, it's making me feel sick. I'm going to hold on. Look how wide everything is. Wow, the views are amazing. Can you imagine being at the top of that one in Dubai? I know. It's about three miles up that one in Dubai. Uh -huh. So the airport's the other side, they're not there. Okay. Woohoo, we've got a table, a decent one, near the window. So this is our current view. I'll give you the, a panoramic swing shot of everything. So we're on the top floor, which is the Star City Bar, coffee lounge. It's the tallest building in Lanzarote. Um, and if you know anything about Lanzarote, you'll know that there's a, a lot of rules about building heights here. And that's the view of RSE for the city. Over there, right there, is the airport that we stood at the end of the other day on the previous vlog. And the winery, the vineyard, is literally over the horizon. And we're going to set off from there once we've done a little bit of exploring of the city centre and possibly a little bit of shopping. You looking forward to that? Yes. So we're just having a chill on this bridge. We're not going to go into that castle because apparently we've looked it up and everything is in Spanish, no translation. So we wouldn't know what was in it. It's three euros to get in, which isn't bad, but we are going to a vineyard soon. So we've not really got that much time. Well, our tour starts in an hour and yeah. 20 minutes. We have to get there, yeah. Definitely worth going to Arrecife though, isn't it? Yeah. Especially for that view from the hotel there. It's brilliant. And we've just been down the shops down there. The arcade, there's lots of nice designer shops. We didn't even do a quarter of it. Yeah, no. We're literally straight across from the castle, straight into the yeah. town. And um, and parking's free next to the, the, the port. Yeah. 
So definitely nice. And there's the port there as well. Can you see the big humongous cruise liner there? So definitely worth a trip to Arrecife. You don't need all day, you need just a few hours I would say. So we're going to head off to the vineyard soon. We're here at the vineyard, really high up in the hillside, a little bit breezy and the sun is going to fry us so I've put my hat on because I know I'm going to get sun tan. So all those little curly things that you see on the hill there, that's where all the vines grow and they capture water apparently. That's what I read on the internet before we came. So I'm going to go self-explore before we go on the tour. It's 45 minutes for the tour but we're going to have a gander around aren't we? Yeah. Maybe a bite to eat. Ooh, okay. A bit of tapas. Nice little pre tour snack. No clothing clothing on it. What is it? Some kind of pizza. Nice. Yeah, the microwave is just right. Chewy. Mm. And a cup of tea. Cup of tea. To line my stomach ready for wine. Mm. Am I driving back then? No, it's just only wine tasting. It's not the wine tasting. I'll drive back. I fancy driving. Oh, yeah. I don't fancy any wine. Right, we've got tickets for the tour. So we're just waiting in this winery place for us tour to start, for us tour to start. that's all the people uh, who've been sampling the wine which uh, Nick will be doing afterwards so we're just waiting to set off on the tour uh, after the last volcanic eruption of Timon Faya okay, by the farmer's hand okay. this last volcanic eruption of Timon Faya where between 1730 to 1736 The, the volcanic stone wall. Okay. Every year we make a maintenance of our holes. We use uh, this, 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 this like our staff has to down at the bottom to the hole to make the pruning. Can you see any wine? <laughs> This, this, yeah. this, well, <coughs> this was made uh, after the last volcano eruption. So, right, so okay. uh, around 250 so years, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> years yeah. okay, more or less. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna jump in. <laughs> These are full of last year's wine. Yeah. Oh, it smells amazing. <laughs> Best bit of the tour. I hope it brings a bit of cheese with it. Wine tasting. You need to get cheese back at the park. <laughs> Bring some cheese. We're waiting for the wine to come out. I want at least five glasses. I don't think you'll be getting that. <laughs> Is it nice? Very nice. Nick's having mine because I'm driving, so I might buy a bottle. Bottle. If it's that nice, I might have a bottle. I've, I've had a sip and it was very nice. I saw on the reviews it's in supermarkets for half the price, so don't bother. What? Half the price, what in shops? I'm here. Oh, yeah, you can smell it sweet. That looks sweet, it looks gloopy. Try it. Describe it to me. Like syrupy sweet. Syrupy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're back at the hotel. We Thanks. survived. Not speaking. 
thanks to my superb driving. We survived. I'm extremely good at driving. I couldn't drive because I'm a little tipsy from the two and a half. No, I had two and a half of my own and two and a half of yours, didn't I? I had a taster of each and they were very nice what I tasted. Very, 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 very nice. So um, we might have a look in the um, shop next door here and see if we can get any. You're rambling. Right, so now we're going to go into I'm the- I'm if I'm rambling. We're going to go into the hotel now and get around the pool and we're going to get a G&T. Come on, come on. Crying out loud. What's all this noise about? What's all this noise about? I'm just doing my face. Put my eyes on, get that noise. I think we're getting a little bit bored of seeing that. Just go and get your Botox. Doing it every day. Exactly, go and get your Botox done then we don't have to see I'm it. bored of seeing you. Piss off. This is what I look beautiful. This is what Nick's like after Two gins around the pool. How many gins did you have around the pool? Five! And I'm absolutely sober. As a Slaughtered. Judge. You're absolutely, you're absolutely <laughs> fine because you're putting it on for the camera to make sure that you don't look like you're like you're hammered. But you really you are. We're going for And a, I've had four, not two. We're going for a meal in the hotel tonight, all inclusive. Where have you gone? What what? What's happening? Something for my shoes. Why are your shoes right under there? Because you've kicked them on. Actually, the I know why they're there. Because I put them on on the morning when I'm editing. Because just in case any cockroaches come. We've only seen one cockroach. I know, but we've seen one cockroach, and that's enough for me to have. Oh to no, put... two then. You. Two. And you oh. and the one in the corner under the crisp bag. Uh, we've seen one, so I have to put shoes on at all times now. Why would you think a cockroach wants to sit on your feet? Are you ready to go out for a meal? No. Will you be ready when you've got your shoes on? Yeah, but my eyes are a bit tight. Do I look a bit panderish? Oh, I can't see you, you're not looking at it. You're making me look up and it will look fantastic. Uh, come on, let's go out for lunch. Tea, dinner. Can I just say that we've had a brilliant day today. And I've actually forgotten what we've done. Oh, we went to a wine club, didn't we? We did. Vineyard. And we saw somebody else from the park. And we went to... Oh, we've not, we've not said that yet. Oh, yeah. So the lady that we saw at the airport the other day, the first one, we went to the vineyard. She's called Janet. And lo and behold, she turned up. We're like, do you know, we can't bloody get away from it. <laughs> anyway, it will and work. We so also we caught had... up with it again and she took a photo to us and put it on Facebook. We had a good time in Arecife at the top of the hotel. Turn the camera around. I we? we had a good time at Arecife, at the top of the hotel. Why don't you want to be on it on your own? Because we're a comedy act. You're the joke and I'm not. <laughs> we had a good time at the top of the hotel. That was amazing, that. I wasn't expecting that. Lee found it on Google this morning. If you're going to go places, Google it first. You'll find all sorts of little secrets out and don't just do the normal tourist stuff. And if you do go to the top of the hotel, the Star... What was it Star called? Star City. Star City. It's actually reasonably priced, like like the same price as anywhere else in Lanzarote. How much were your orange juice? Four euros. Four pound fifty for an orange juice. And you think that's reasonably priced? For a freshly squeezed orange. Two quid of that. What, for your pink lift? Let's go out for a meal. Come on then. We're back from our meal. I'm bloody knackered. I'm tired. We've had a busy few days, haven't we? No, it's the fact that we have five jeans inside a pool. Would you like to finish today's vlog, please? I did it last bye, night. Bye, everybody. No, do it properly. Subscribe below, bye. No. You do it. I've done it every night this week. I did it last night, actually. Hey, balls are sore. If you're not already a subscriber, please click on the subscribe button to become a lodger. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on our future videos. Hit the like button. And if you feel like it, share it with all your friends. And we're about thumbs up. Thumbs up as well. I'm sure I said that. You didn't. We'll see you tomorrow for another vlog. We're hopefully maybe chilling tomorrow. Possibly. Goodbye. We have two more full days left. One will be chilling, one will be going somewhere. Goodbye. Bye.